Hey guys, Nick Sarity here, and welcome back to some more of Assassin's Creed Liberation. Where we last left off, I think I was about to go see my mom. Nope, that's not a quest marker. Excuse me. I've played maybe slightly too much uh, Witcher in the last couple of days. There's a thing up here. Memory. Deciphering clues left behind by her long lost mother lead Aveline to an entrance where a treasure hunt begins. Oh, there's more things. Supposed to be above me. I don't really know. Nope. All right. Well, I hope this is safe. Ooh. Well, that was cool. Terrifying, but mostly cool. It would be fun if they implemented more of that into some more Assassin's Creed games. creepy. Where are we going? Deeper and deeper still. Oh. Oh my. Yeah, we're crawling. Thank you. Huh. 
Like, I'm probably ten times more worried than I really need to be, but... This all begs one question. How are we gonna get back? Oh, mother fudger. Oh, I hate these precarious leaps. Oh no. Mm -mm. All right, where are we going? these guys or nope all right cool come come on in in you go into the water there we go terrifying. Where am I going now? up there. Ah. Oh, jeez. I don't know how many times I've said it, but I hate heights. Somebody who may or may not have been wise once said that, uh, it's not the uh, fear of heights, it's the fear of falling. I was like, then how do you explain that I look up at something and am terrified? Would you look at this? No. Really? All right. I don't like this. I also don't like that she sounds like I, I made her stay underwater for like an hour every time she comes up for air. Like, come now. Well, this one is an interesting thing. Huh. 
solve the puzzle. This is really bizarre. I used to play with these things all the time when I was a kid. Come on. I'm pleasantly surprised that the ball moves a lot slower than the ones that I played with as a kid. This is really cool, though. Come on. In you go. There we go. Ooh, what's that? Oh god. Explosions. <laughs> How wonderfully useful you are. You remove those who would supersede me in rank. You find pieces of the prophecy disc, saving me the effort. <laughs> if you weren't my enemy, I would take you for my friend. Our aims must not be so different for all the help you give me. Oh dear. Come on. We go. Oh, God. Oh, come on. Can, can, can I maybe a little bit? No. Ah, 
there we go. Okay. God, that was weird. Aveline, Mama, it can't be. I left you in Madeline's protection for your own safety. You and my heart. What cruel destiny brings you now? And carrying the blade of the enemy? Don't tell me. I thought you were dead. Mama was a Templar. Please understand. They would have killed me. Taken my heart. I never wanted to leave you. Is that it? Has Agate sent you here to kill me? Please tell me you do not hate me so much. I would not have left. Kill you? No, I, I, I came here on my own. Aveline, the disc can never fall into Agate's hands. If it did, everything I've been working to find and protect since leaving Nouvelle Orléans would be destroyed. How do you know him? And why are you so afraid? Long ago. No. I'm sorry, Aveline. I hope you can forgive me someday. I wanted the story, no. though. That's not fair. That is so not fair. And incredibly rude. With Defer dead and the slave colony free, Evelyn travels back to New Orleans. Upon her return, she finds a new world, a very different one than what she left. Yet the identity of the company man remains a mystery. That was, that was rude. I wanted the story. I wanted to know. Damn it. <sighs> okay. I'll wait. as though you've seen a ghost. I left Chichen Itza the moment it was secure. Then you were... Uh, successful? De Ferrer will no longer trouble us. But there is more to this story. Uh, plenty. Always. I have much to tell you as well. In Spanish, uh... Sympathetic to our aims now. New laws may ease your efforts to help the slaves. Okay. Could it be that for the first time, home holds more comfort than conflict? With you back, it feels like home again. Uh. I'm afraid I must now spoil your homecoming with a business. There has been strange activity. Men in Spanish uniforms raising havoc in the bayou. Still? I thought you said Spanish interests are now aligned with ours. That's what makes it so... strange. Are they secretly working for... That's what we need to find out. I have one need. An informant has seen a man bribing soldiers in town. For who? I'll investigate. Aren't you forgetting something? No. Please, Gerald. Now is not the time. Uh, I, um... Uh, well, I merely meant to, to give you... Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. My actual oh, equipment. Uh, thank you. Now stop hitting on me. <laughs> oh. It's been too long. That's great. Ah, there's the guy. Oop, nope. Okay. 
Oh, now you trigger it. Thanks. There we go. All right, where is he going? Tailing this guy too. I just stepped into a group of bickering men. Oh, okay. Good, I didn't have to tail him very far. My employer is prepared to be very generous. So it seems. Then you will join our cause? See. Stop her! Am I supposed to fight these guys? Nope. Alright. Just catch that guy. Ugh, I hate it when people have head starts. They're so hard to catch. Please tell me there was no way I could have caught him. Gotta get in there. Somehow. It would uh, definitely help if it would have given me that earlier. Ah, there we go. Oh, there's a guy there. Oh, there's a guy there.
Okay, so where's the guy out here? Okay, there's, there's the guy. Oh, there's two of them. Three of them? I don't think that worked. Use a powder keg. Nah. Well, that was easy. I have to admit, I may be a tiny bit disappointed about it. Senor, perhaps you underestimate the vast, winding expanse of the bayou. I will repeat. I need enough men to control all of it. Recruit the entire Spanish army if you must. Yours in absolute discretion. Vasquez. Hmm. Interesting. Vasquez? De Ferrer mentioned him in Chichen Itza. Is he the company man? I don't know. I must warn Agate and the smugglers. To the bayou! Discovering a plot to force her mentor out of hiding, Aveline journeys back to the bayou, determined to win back his trust, and refusing to give up on the Brotherhood. Alrighty. See, how would you have even known about that? Teach. Agate. Who? Who are you? You look 
like a faithful student I had once. Long ago. She no longer exists. Ugh. Mentor, I know you have doubted me. But please, my absence has not been in vain. Look what I found. You should have left it where it lay. Do you have any idea of its purpose or power? Nope. I was hoping you could enlighten. Had you not insisted on dredging it up, no one would need to know. Remove it from my sight. Bury it and forget the spot. Grind it into powder. Plant it under an alligator nest. Let me never lay eyes on it again. Okie dokie. Very well. I had thought you would accept it as confirmation of my loyalty. My... Someone told me you were looking for it. You should not allow gossip to infect your mind. Now be gone. Not before I warn you, Mentor. You are not safe here. Have I not been telling you this for years? Useless child. Ugh. This threat is new and very real. A man, Vasquez. I am aware. He bribes Spanish troops. But I already have plans to outwit them. You're gonna die. I will use their superstition against them. Mm hmm Let me help. I know I cannot stop you. You will see. My loyalty is real. Very well. Listen closely. See if you can follow this plan. I have planted signs, which our dear European friends find terrifying. If you are able to follow the instructions, you may tail them from sign to sign and eliminate them silently, giving the appearance of a voodoo curse. Oh, yes. <clears throat> and then? A curse may frighten them, but will it be enough to stop the flow of new recruits? More questions. I thought you were here to help. Ah, silence at last. Go now before you spoil this moment. I'm sorry that I think farther ahead than you do. Jesus. Well, you know, since we're going to be putting a voodoo curse on, on some poor Spanish soldiers, uh, we, we might as well do that in the next episode. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and leave it a like. Leave your comments, thoughts, feelings, concerns, and all that jazz down in the comments below. I look forward to reading it. Anyway, thanks again so much, guys. Go ahead and subscribe for more great content. This is Nick Sarity signing off. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.